What up, Dapper Squad? It's your boy Darius back at it again with more One Piece. Today we're doing 365 to 368. We are continuing Thriller Bark. We've had some great moments last session, but now all chaos is ensuing. Hopefully we can turn it back in our favor. I have no idea how that would happen, though. Remember to check out that Patreon if you guys want the early access up to 16 episodes, as well as the full uncut versions of all these reactions. We are live on Twitch watching all these, so it is also a great vibe. Come on over and leave a follow. Twitch.tv slash Dapper Darius. Um, and check out the other social medias instagram twitter TikTok, all at dapper darius much appreciated one piece episode 365 let's do it all right this is 365. Right, yep so the gang's finally gonna reunite after all splitting up i'm happy you missed it Usopp. we can't explain it to you we had a whole thing up here I like Orz's design a lot, don't get me wrong, but I think I like normal giants better. Luffy is my enemy. Heck no, Luffy is you. Gotta relight the Siggy. You know Sanji's getting serious when the Sig gets lit. Bird brain thing to say. That's what I'm saying. It's weird hearing Luffy's voice actor or actress, I think it's a woman, inside such a crazy big monster. Yeah, Chopper, you're rightfully so scared that much. You should be. Yeah. Yeah. That's kind of funny. It's a benefit that Sandy's picture is like that. <laughs> He's like, oh, you're not on my list. Uh, you're free to go. That's hilarious. That's hilarious. He's like, damn it. <laughs> damn it. Oh, God. Here we go now. Here we go. As Luffy is still chasing Moria. Hit him with a gum gum ankle grab or something, Luffy. As I say that, damn it. I get proven wrong every time. I love that nickname, Giant Shallot. They're just, it's actually like, how do you defeat a shadow? I don't think you can. We need like light or I don't know how we'd be <laughs> like, it's so broken. And we're back to the ceremony with Absalom. He's still feeling the effects of Sandy's barrage. You better not kiss our girl. Oh, is Lola gonna pop in? We haven't seen her in a grip. Oh, that's quite the kiss. Now, now you guys are married. So you just come in here, kiss each other, and he's dipping now? Hit him with the invisible bazooka. This guy Moria, I tell you. He even runs funny. No, that'd be crazy. Sickle. He has his arm like that, like a sickle. If anyone would know, it's Robin. Legendary Continent Polar. God damn! Always oh, gonna slam him in on the ground like that? Shout out, Usa. We do know zombies hate fire. That was quick thinking. Maybe this will just make him drop him. Sumimasen. He's like, there's two of them. 
He's like, but the one Usab's not on the list. I want to see Zoro use that sword so bad. Okay, what are you about to do, my man? It's the same move he did against Kaku. Just increases his strength insanely. Two Gorilla Slash. Cut off one of his... Tut? Oh, his fangs. Okay. Thought it was one of his horns. Zoro just got sent. Great way to alleviate someone's fall. Bro, how are we going to defeat this thing? Salt. I should go right into his mouth. It's not enough, though, is it? Six little balls. We need like a bowling ball size amount of salt. Yeah, we need a lot more. Like, I want to. I want to say Luffy beat Moria so the shadow can return and we'll be fine, but I don't even think Luffy's fight's going to be able to go that quick. <sighs> I was hoping maybe the salt kicked back in Luffy's pro uh, personality a little bit. I don't know, man. This is all hitting the fan, man. All right, this is the next episode, 366. She's still thinking about the cockroaches. Does she have a nightmares or something? Or does she just wake up and they're still all fake? I think she's having nightmares. Of a giant Usopp with a 10 ton hammer. What kind of voice is that? That would be more creepy waking up to that. Oh, what are you eating? Did he have to eat the, the sticky stuff? Yeah. Oh, that's gross, bro. That sounds disgusting. Yeah, the Perona fight was hilarious. She's already back in the game, in the game though. How is she going to be involved? Maybe if we put some negative ghosts through ores, maybe he'll stop this rampage. He did step on Hogback. Rona thinks he's looking for her, but I think he's actually looking for Nami. She said, I'm out of here. You are not taking our thousand Sunny, that's for damn sure. If I were her, though, I'd be dipping too. I can't lie. Ors is a little too much for me. Back to this BS. I'm praying on Lola. 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 Oh, she woke up. About damn time, Nami. Thank the Lord. He's like, give it up. She's got the moves on her. Oh. No, no, don't curse us. We did this against our will. He literally forcibly made us do this, Lola. We didn't want to. Oh, no. I want you to turn your anger and attention towards Absalom. <laughs> cool. You do look great in that dress. I'm not, I'm not going to deny that. But... It's not time for you to get married now. You gotta wait till me and her get married, you know? <laughs> he said, hell no. Come on, Absalom. You gotta have someone who wants you. You know what I'm saying? Oh, she's a man. That, uh, but he's... That's a great tactic. That's a not bad tactic. Pursuing him. We've been chasing the dude. We got a fat old schmang. That's what I was saying, though. He did see us in the bathroom. 
But you went in there beforehand. He's such a goober. So that's why I'm like, is he not going to believe the man plan? <laughs> because we... All of the bouncy parts were there. W Lola. W Lola. Is he going to attack her? That's kind of fucked up, bro. This woman's been all about you this whole time. Tommy's not going to be about that. You're attacking a the woman who loves you. I like how Lola and Nami were such rivals, antagonists to each other, and now they actually care about each other. Damn, Absalom. Whip out that climb attack, Nami, and beat Absalom's ass. Because we're not dealing, Astro Friend OD, we're not dealing with this bullshit no more. With the climb attack, oh yeah, it's time for some Nami action. Nami Swan! Let's load some electricity up in this man. You want to feel the jolts of love, right? My friendo. Esto friendo. Looking real bright in this room. I gotta turn, close the blinds. That's what I'm saying. Esto friendo. How dare you hurt Lola? Such an interesting twist. We gotta. Mm. Hopefully that's enough to get my man. Last time he shocked him, he said, yeah, is this what love feels like? Looks to have worked. Understandable. Sanji did kick his ass. He had to use invisibility to his advantage. Good job, Nami. You did something. Now let's uh, talk to Lola. So funny. Yeah, that was your advantage. He did the same thing to Nami, you do the same thing to him. You go, Lola, you get your mans. Rose, oars, use. The gang is finally away from his barrage. Got the bandana coming on. We're getting serious. That is not the shot I needed of Frankie. I won't lie. That was a straight up dick shot. Ooh, he's got the giant nunchucks though. Facts. Talk your shit. Dun, 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 dun. Okay, okay, okay. All right, this is episode 377. 77? 67. 367. I'm a little lost sometimes. Lola got her man. Yeah, Nami has been out for a little bit. We'll leave you to him. You got that, girly. Round two, oars versus the straw hats has begun. They look so ready for this fight. I'm loving it. Starting off hot with a gum gum butt drop. That's a new move. Not his nuts, that's his butt. <laughs> Pause. All right. 
Tactics 15. Time for some amazing teamwork. Just hold my legs. What the hell are they talking about? Ooh, I love Frankie's theme. My man's going Power Rangers Zord mode? Oh, what the fuck is going on? Ew, I love the way they're animating this. This is literally like a Power Rangers. <laughs> Pirates Docking 6. Giant Robot Warrior. When they have those city-sized battles with this... <laughs> I'd be like, Zoro, bro, what the f*** am I doing? Ooh, Robin? Robin is not about that Power Rangers life. I understand that. <laughs> I understand that. Even Oris is shocked. He's like, I was liking it. He's like, if you had Robin Doc now, I'd have been nervous. But other than that, you guys are fine. Just five of you? Well, damn. <laughs> He's blushing. <laughs> we could have become Robot Warrior Big Emperor. I actually like the way they animated that in that title. That is so funny. Don't ask me to dock with you. Come on, Robin. I love you, but that would have been sick. I still can't get over that. <laughs> Big Emperor. <laughs> that was so funny. Alright, soccer ball player. Sanji would be great <laughs> in the Premier League. In the Champions League. I used to love milk. I've recently switched over to almond milk. My body doesn't like dairy as much as it used to, you know. But shout out milk, man. I guess technically he's a bone. He's a skeletal system. So calcium would probably repair him. I can feel the calcium. Okay. Okay. Shout out Brooke. I guess how cola is to Frankie what milk is to him. That does scream suspicious. A door like that, locked up in the kitchen. What do we got in here? Sanji with the boost on Zoro. Oh, that's clean. That's clean. That... Super fencing. Animation is looking clean right now. Got the hundred hands going after the joints. Hit a tree of hands. Okay. <laughs> I know we didn't get the direct teamwork with the big emperor docking style, whatever, but we're still having a lot of teamwork right here. <laughs> this guy's playing Minecraft. Yeah, it has no sta stability, it has no support beams. They used that just to get to the height they needed to. Super Frapper Gong. See, I love the teamwork. Nah, real talk? Animation is looking clean. They did some great teamwork to get this man knocked over. We just scored our first knockdown. You guys are playing, not playing, you guys are wrestling, you know? Professional wrestlers. Yeah, touche. The entire island of Thriller Bark, this whole mansion area is just demolished. You're a bunch of meanies. Yeah, you started this, buddy.
interesting. Understandable. Like I said, if I was you, I would be dipping too. Can't blame you. But you're not dipping on Thousand Sunny. That's for sure not what's going to happen. Oh! Is that actually Kuma? Bartholomew? That is the guy who was with Doflamingo during the meeting during Jaya during Skypea. Kuma! Oh hell nah. Alright, this is uh 368, the last episode of the session. No idea what's going on. We have two of the seven warlords on this island right now. Why is he here? He said, is this where I can find Moria? I'm just going to beat on him while he's stuck in the ground. They should. Oh, Robin looks like a hot D. Oh, oh. But he did break out. Retreat time. You guys are like devils. And what are we gonna do? We're not giant, but we're the robot warrior. Docking complete. All right. I love how he launches people off. A robot shoot. We're a small elite force. He's gonna punch himself in the head. Not a bad plan. <laughs> he's like, what the fuck? I helped with that? Now he's like, hey, look, I helped with that. I'm hoping Brooke can come with, I hope, was a mountain load of salt. Looks, I mean, that would make sense why it's locked up in the kitchen like that. We need to purify the fuck out of ores. Not a bad plan either. That sword is so clean. Black blade known for its strength. Even if a dinosaur steps on it, it won't bend. It's so sick. I love the design. Finally. Owazamono Shusui. Back to the three sword style. And we're back to the thousand sunny. Show me Kuma again. Nami's here. Oh shit. Nami and Kuma? Grouped up with Perona at the thousand sunny? That is not a story I ever would have imagined I'd be hearing. What you mean? We're gonna defeat you and take your treasure and our shit back. Tommy's always up for a fight. Her fighting in that wedding dress. I'm not sure we can take Corona though. Her ability is super broken. My nemesis is Mr. Negative Nose and him alone. That's hilarious. My god, the size difference. And I didn't notice this when we got that episode with him and Doflamingo, but he's always carrying around a Bible. That's super interesting. He is huge. I did not realize how big he was. Bartholomew Kuma. He's the tyrant. What is he going to do? Is he going to be cordial and have a conversation? Or is he going to start smashing his way through stuff? Let's see if the negative hollows work on him. Weird, every time I say hollow now, I think of in Bleach. 
He's reading his Bible. Ooh, takes his glove off. Where the hell did she go? Is that his devil fruit power? Is that why he keeps his gloves on? Because if he touches anything barehanded, they just can disappear to the void of nothingness? What the f happened? His face, the way they shade him from, and we're always looking at, up at him, is always so intimidating. They just fucking dipped out of there. Understandable, too. Nami, this is not looking too good. Yeah, because they got the whole rundown. What the hell? Man teleported. And he's gone again. What the hell is going on, bruh? Little do you know that's just his shadow. God damn it, man. God damn it. All right. Those episodes were fantastic from the teamwork with the straw hats between the docking system with Frankie. That was hilarious. Nami fighting Absalom. I loved it. Lola being a W woman. Shout out to her. But everything changed when the Fire Nation attacked. I mean, when Kuma showed up. Like, what the hell? That was literally the last thing I was expecting. And he's looking for Moria. He's asking about Luffy's older brother. And I'm genuinely so curious about his powers. His piousness because he has a bible with him what his motivations are why is he here what does he want i'm so curious are we gonna go from thriller bark fighting moria directly into fighting kuma or is it gonna be one of those things where it's like he reveals some stuff to us and then dips and we fight him in 100 episodes you know because in terms of plot lines story threads this that and the third the only thing i know is that I think it's Dress Rosa, or I think that has to do with Do Flamingo. Other than that, I don't know when we fight any of the warlords, when we do any of the other things. I literally know nothing. And I could be even incorrect on that. So I'm really curious if we're going to go double warlord back to back or how this is going to play out. Because this is getting crazy. Um, shout out Bartholomew, Kuma. Shout out <laughs> the Straw Hats for how they took down Ors. Shout out Nami for trying to like, oh, wow, this is getting real. So I know the next session we're going to be, we're going to be zooming. We're going to be done with Thriller Bark next week. So I'm super excited. This has been a, like people tell me like it was like a lot of their least favorite arcs because of just the, the, the funniness of it, but it's easily one of the funniest arcs, but I'm really enjoying this arc so far. I won't lie. I am super curious man 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 hopefully you guys enjoyed these reactions just like i did if you did please leave a like on this video let me know your thoughts down below check out the patreon for 16 episodes early access as well as the full length like i always say we're live on twitch watching this it is always a vibe come on over and leave a follow twitch.tv slash don't forget to drink some water tell someone you love them have a great day dapper squad peace out